Also, the alarming number of letter carriers who are being attacked by dogs and what Canada Post wants pet owners to do about it. That story next. Canada Post is warning if nothing changes, one of its lower mainland carriers could be injured or even killed by a dangerous dog. The corporation is biting back at pet owners who, it says, need to be more responsible for their dogs. And a warning, you might find some of the images in this story disturbing. Peter Granger reports. Sometimes the public trusts their dog too much. And, and we can't, we can't trust them because every day somebody is being bitten. Donna McIntosh isn't exaggerating. The career letter carrier is recovering from a bite last month. There was no time for her to pull out her pepper spray to stop the dog. He ran from the kitchen of the house right out to the front door, through the, by the owner, and jumped in the air and grabbed. Although it was a small dog, it still left McIntosh with this nasty bite on her thigh, resulting in a handful of stitches, a painful tetanus shot, and a growing fear of dog attacks. These are photos of bites on other workers from the past few weeks. Canada Post says the number of dog bites in the Lower Mainland has doubled over the past year, with at least one bite happening every day. People are becoming more free with their pets, just like they're becoming more free with their children. They're letting them roam a little bit more freely. The corporation, along with veterinarians and dog experts, alerted the media about the biting trend today, telling us how attacks can be prevented by following a few practical steps. Like when you're not home to control your dog, leave it inside, not alone in the yard. Every time he barks at a kid rolling by um, on a skateboard or a postie walking by, they go away. That makes it clearer in his head that I am doing the right thing, I'm defending the realm, and I can do it more aggressively. And he ratchets it up in that way. Look at me. Good boy. It'll cost you anywhere from $50 to $120 and an hour a week for six to eight weeks, but stats show enrolling in a basic dog training course means it'll be a 90% less chance for your pooch to go postal. Like, even if they say their dog's never bitten before, every dog has the potential to bite, and we're in the front line. And it seems obvious, but when a letter carrier does come to the door, you're advised to keep Fido restrained. If your pet does injure someone, no matter who it is, you may be liable for damages of your own. Peter Granger, CTV News, Delta.